Four right. Come on, get in there. Finally. That was an alright wee dig. That was an alright dig. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, it has to be. Surely. Welcome back to another video on the channel where today we're up here at the lovely Green Acres Golf Club where we're going to be doing a nine hole course lock guys. Nine holes, currently playing off a 12 handicap. How well can we do? Let's just get straight to the video, huh? No talking, more action. Let's just get it, come on. Sorry about the audio there guys in the first hole, it wasn't great. Uh, so anyway, hole two, par four, not a great start. We need a, a good birdie or a par to keep ourselves going here. Four right! It's leaking right. It's not a great start guys, we're falling apart, we're falling apart. Shot two, the golf's not started great guys. The first hole we had problems with the microphones. And hole two, it's just not been a great start. So we're on the wrong fairway, seven iron in hand. Let's see if we can get one there. Oh my god, it has to be. Surely. Come down. Just up there, right hand side of the green, guys. Not a bad strike. So, shot free. We're still short of the green, believe it or not. Well, we're actually in line with the green, but just the wrong alignment, let's just say. But 50 at the green hand. Need to try and turn it around here a little bit. 50 at the green hand. Just get one in the air. And let it roll out a little bit. It's all uphill from here. Come on, you need to kick left. Kick left. Tell you what guys, it's not bad, we're par putting, which is actually okay. So can we get a par? Can we redeem yourself with a par? We can't be going three or four over. Three, two holes. Keep going, baby. Keep going. That's three over. Exactly what we didn't want. Tap in, bogey. And there's the bogey, guys. Ah! We need some good golf to start coming in and play here, because this isn't great at the minute, guys. So hole free, it's a par three, playing downhill. It says it's 179 yards, but I've lasered it at 156. So we've got an eight iron in hand. Hope we get one down here on the green. It's actually, the flag's actually tucked away behind the bunker here to the right. So they saw the iron downhill here, come on. Oh, this is beautiful. Surely that's on the dance floor. Bit left, there's the usual draw coming in. Yeah, just before the bunker there, guys, the left hand side, it wasn't a bad strike, not bad. So shot two, 58 degree in hand. You probably figured out that's the club I use most of the time around the greens. It's just the club I've been comfortable with. So it's 58 degree. Just try and get one. The nip on just before the fringe and let it roll out. Oh, this could be lovely. Oh, this could be lovely. Keep going. It's just not enough, too much height. Not bad, we're par putting. So we have this big putt for par. Can we get it? It is big. We can't be going. Honestly, can't. we really cannot be affording to go four over three, three holes. No. Come on, please, no. I need this for bogey. There we have it, a bogey. Honestly, guys, as the saying goes, you either have good days and bad days, and I think at the minute it's going to be a bad day, but let's try and turn it around. So, hole four, par four, as you know, it's, I think it's 324 yards, it's not the biggest of par fours, never reaching it in a million years, in the wind as well, big dog in hand, the aim here is hopefully, aim slightly left of the bunkers down there, and let my usual fade come in the play. Oh my god. Just make the bunkers, because it's in the wind. Oh, Jesus, yeah, we're well over the bunkers. Not a bad strike, come on. Shot two, we're left with about 100 yards, guys. In the wind, that shot also. Didn't go anywhere, really. The wind's literally just held it in the air, so we're pitching wedge in hand. Let's try and get one on it here. Beat of club. 
There's the draw again. Drawing everything at the minute. We're not on the green, but the left hand side of it. Keep drawing everything. Show free, I've got a pitching wedge in hand. I'm just going to try and bump one up this little hill here. Hopefully it just lands around the top and just rolls a little bit. Here's the hoping. Greens are quick, hopefully it rolls out a bit. If I could aim, it would be great for one, but no, we're on the green, we're power putting. So, that chip there wasn't the greatest, as you can see. I've left it absolutely majestic for power. It is a big, big putt for power. Just trying to line it up, it's definitely sloping to the left. I'm going to go right edge of the cup, hopefully it comes down. Turn, where's the turn? Ah, that's another top end bogey, come on. Need some powers in the cards. There it is, another bogey in the cards, guys. And that's, I think we're currently five over. This isn't great, isn't great. So we're now in currently hole five. It's another par four, it's 380 yards. The wind is, at the minute, cutting across to the right-hand side. So I'm gonna try and aim this one a good bit left. As you know, I play a bit of a, a strong fade at, at the minute. So play it a little bit left, and then hopefully it comes in middle fairway. Tell you what, it's a little bit leaky, but it's still turning. Well, that's a big hit. That is a big, big hit. We shouldn't have too far left for that one. Not bad, come on. So, currently stuck with 100 yards. We're on the rough rim between the fair two fairways here from the previous hole. Pitching wedge in hand. Let's just try and get one out of it here. Oh, I tell you what, this could be good. Get down. Oh, we're actually short. Wow, didn't hit it enough. So, shot free, we're actually a good bit short here. So we are, have a bunker to go over, and a little bit of green after the, a little bit of a rough to go off after the bunker. So, 50 at the green hand, just try and pop one up, let it roll out. This could be lovely. Oh, look at the bounce of everything. Exactly what I wanted, but I just didn't get enough of a kick. So then we're on the green, we're power putting. Can we finally get a par on the card? Can we finally get a par? It's a big par. If I get this, I'll be happy. Hopefully the golf game starts changing a bit here. Come on. Come down, baby. Come down. Oh my God. That wasn't a bad effort. You know, that was not a bad effort. Tap in bogey. There we have it. Another bogey, guys. Honest to God, it's bogey golf today. Bogey golf today, we can't complain. So currently in hole six, it's par three. It's a lovely par three over water, guys. Love this hole. Uh, my natural shot at the minute is still a draw, so I'm gonna play a pitching wedge. It's 136 yards, I'm gonna aim it slightly right. Oh, this could be good. Here, I usually play a draw, and that did not draw at all. Wow, just the right-hand side. I mean, left-hand side of the bunker to the right. Wow, no draw on it at all. So shot, shot two, I've pulled it left hand side. I've pulled it to the right to the left hand side of the bunker. Get your words right. <laughs> Pitch your wedge in hand, just go try and bump one up here. Hit the hill. This it probably looked a bit hard there, but it wasn't. Big hill to go up there, you probably can't see it on camera, but we're on par putting. Big massive putt for par. Well, it's not actually the biggest. It looked big from back there, but. Now this is definitely sloping to the left. And it's downhill after the flag, so. Oh my god. Honestly, you cannot write this. It's gonna be another top end bogey. There we have it, guys. A top end bogey. Still no bars in the cards. They will come. They will come. So, currently in hole seven, it's the hardest hole in the course. It's 440 yards. Stroke index one. It's a big, it's a big hole, honestly. In the wind as well, no excuses, but we are in the wind. Uh, big dog in hand, play this one left, wind's coming at me, so I think naturally it is going to go left if I'm right, um, it's going to go right if I'm uh, So let's try and get one down here. Big go left, but it went bloody right, in them trees again, every time down there. Yeah, I've heard a tree as well, let's go looking for that one. So currently in the long stuff, in the trees as well, I have got a gap, luckily enough. But if I think if I play it through here, I'm actually going to have another little tree or a big tree to get over. So I'm going to risk it. I'm going to hit an 8-iron. An 8-iron should get over these two trees and it should get over the other tree and the little small one as well, hopefully. So 8-iron in hand. Oh my god. 
What an absolute strike. Whew. So, a shot for you guys. We did pull it lit. I mean, we did go right a little bit. We did obviously come over the top of it, I'm guessing. Felt better than that there, but I didn't really see it take off. But pitching wedge in hand, go take a bit off it. It's in the wind here. We're still not on. Pitch wedge in hand, just trying to get one, on, one up. Hopefully on the dance floor. That was really bad. That was a real bad shot, but we're on the green. What in the absolute earth was that? And we think we just roll off the back of the green, guys. My golf game is poor today. So, currently hitting shot four. This is for par. Honestly, you have days you play well and you have days you play bad. But last time I was out on this course, I actually shot 80. And the day before that was 88. And of course here to struggle to break 100. And I've bloody finned it. I've absolutely found it. Guys, I am struggling. I am absolutely struggling. What am I doing? Shot five. Can we get it in? It's a shot five. This goes in, I swear. See if we do green this again. Oh my god, my golf. Well, I think this is for a double bogey, guys. This is for a double bogey. This is literally one to forget about. I must be sitting at least nine or ten over at the moment, maybe more. But this is for a double bogey. Come on, bit of positive vibes, Dave. Come on. There's nothing positive about this. Could be a triple going on the quad bogey. Quad bogey. It could possibly be if I miss this on one hole. There it is, triple bogey guys. That is really one to forget about there. Triple bogey in hole seven. So, yeah, as you can see, it's not been great. It's not been a great front nine, let's just say. It's not been a great nine hole course log, but it's good on us golf at its best and its finest. Triple bogey in that last hole, wow. But anyway, hole eight, dog leg par five, wind against, big dog in hand. Let's try and turn something around here. Two holes to finish the nine hole course log. Can we do it? Can we turn things around? Big dog in hand. Oh my God. What an absolute bullet. Hit the top of the hill and roll, go. For the top of the hill. And I think I still see it up there at the top of the hill. That's better. That's a better strike, come on. So we found the fairway. It must be one of the first drives we found the fairway in. The right fairway as well. So five wooden hand. It's playing in the wind, wind's cutting across that way. Let's just try and get a nice solid five wood down here. Tell you what, that was a little bit nearly off the hill, and that's going left to right. It's bounced just before, stop, 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 stop. Over the trees down here and just before the bunker. It's not a bad shot. Come on. Shot free, just before the bunker, 58 degree in hand. As you know, try and put one in the air here. I really needed to get to get the ball landing. Literally just before the hill, or just on top of the hill as it starts. And that's what I did not need there. That is going to roll right back down. You'd think I'd learn my lesson from last time. I should have hit a nine iron, just let it, or a pitching wedge tour and just let it bump over. But we're still on the green, it's second. Yeah, we're still on the green. Two pop par, hopefully. Can we get this? Can we get this? So. This is a big uphill, and I mean this hill is massive, as you can probably see me on the camera. You probably can't see me, I should say. Big hill to go up, and it's going to, it's, it is sloping to the left. So I'm going to have to welly this one. Right, come down left now, come on. Be good, be good ball. See what I mean guys, that hardly even turned. That literally hardly even turned. But this for par now, can we get the par? Oh my god, it's another bloody bogey. Can you believe it? Bogeys are flying at me today. Another bogey. So we're now in, currently in hole nine, guys. It's the last hole of the nine hole course log. And I just want to say, sorry, the golf has not been great at the moment. It really has not been great at the moment. But anyway, this hole nine. Still not even got a par. Played eight holes, we've not got a par. It's been bogey golf, and then forget about that. Hole seven that absolutely murdered me, which was a seven on it on a par four. But we all have them, so let's just try and stay positive. 
Big drive over the second bunker here to the right. That's where I'm aiming. The right hand side. Let's try and get one down here. Four right. And last time I played this hole, I'm the exact same shot. There's a green over there just over the trees to the right hand side. And there's a good chance I'm either on it or I'm short of it. Not a great strike. So shot two, we were actually short of the actual green. So seven iron in hand. We go over this tree. Oh my god, I've just hit the tree. And we're just going over the top of the hill. Ah, not a great shot guys. So playing shot three, shot two was very unfortunate there. Literally the last branch on the tree there. That I think that probably would have made it. So pitch and wedge in hand. We're stuck at about 70 yards. Pitch and wedge in hand, I'm gonna take a bit off it. 58 degree, I'm not trusting it on this hill. That was an alright wee dig. That was an alright dig. We're on the green, need a stick. Pot him downhill, birdie pot. Come on, we finally have this for a birdie. I'm not even going for the birdie. And you might think I'm crazy. I'm not being crazy. I'm trying to be smart. I've not had a par yet out of eight holes. I'm on currently in hole nine. This is for birdie plus putting downhill. So I'm hardly even going to hit this. I am just going to try and get the par. I know it's probably, I think it's stroke index 13 or something, 14. But I'm going to aim slightly right. Hopefully the ball does the rest of the work. Get a nice little tap in par. Most likely going to be a bogey, I'm telling you. Anyway, birdie putt. This is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Look, watch the roll. Watch the roll. Stop. Wow. And that's what you call big for par. That is a big putt for par. Now, I did say I wasn't joking you how much it rolls downhill. It's pretty steep. So we've got an uphill putt for par. Don't mind these. Look straight enough. Just going to go right out the pin. Come on. Get in there. Finally. There we have it, guys. A par hole nine. Sorry there wasn't many of them today, and sorry there was definitely no birdie, because it's very rare to get them. But anyway, it's a par hole nine, and that's the end of a nine hole course vlog. But guys, you know the drill, if you haven't yet liked the video, go down, smash it. And uh, yeah, if you haven't yet subscribed, we very much appreciate it. But yeah, go down there, hit that subscribe button. And until then, I'll see you next time on the channel. Hope you enjoyed. Cheers.